Subscribe to our channel for more videos. Hi kids, welcome back to Sci Sci Toys. Today we're gonna read Tangled Best Wedding Day Ever. Spring had sprung and Flynn invited Rapunzel to take a special trip with him. Where are we going? she asked. If I tell you, it'll ruin the surprise, Flynn said with a grin. Max and Pascal decided to come along too. That evening, Flynn took Rapunzel out on the lake. The lovely night reminded them of times past. Flynn wanted to ask Rapunzel to marry him. He reached into his pocket to find the ring, but it wasn't there. It was still on the shore with Max. Luckily, Max noticed the same thing. He sent Pascal flying toward the boat, carrying the ring. Now that Flynn had the ring, he asked Rapunzel, Will you marry me? Of course, Rapunzel said. On their way home, Rapunzel wanted to tell everyone the happy news. Their friends at the Snuggly Duckling were delighted. Everyone offered to help the couple with the wedding. Attila helped Rapunzel design a cake. They baked and iced and finally, Rapunzel had the perfect wedding cake. For the decorations, Rapunzel and Tord looked at many fancy bouquets, but it took a field of wildflowers to please Rapunzel. Then Flynn and Rapunzel asked Pascal and Maximus a very important question. Will you be our ring bearers? They answered with a delighted squeal and a neigh. When it came time to find a dress, Rapunzel tried on gown after gown, but none of the dresses were quite right, so Rapunzel decided to create her own. She sketched and sketched until the design was exactly what she wanted. On the morning of the wedding, everyone waved to the king and queen in the royal coach. When the coach arrived at the church, the king greeted Rapunzel. He proudly took her arm and the ceremony began. Flynn beamed as Rapunzel walked down the aisle. Meanwhile, something had happened to the ring bearers. Max had sneezed and Flynn's and Rapunzel's wedding rings had rolled away. Max chased one ring and Pascal chased the other right through all the reception decorations. They arrived back at the ceremony just in time. Max and Pascal had saved the wedding by finding the rings, but everything for the reception had been ruined. But Rapunzel and Flynn didn't have to worry for long. The friends who had helped them plan their special day also helped them clean up. Soon the couple was dancing happily. As Tor adjusted the last of the flowers, Rapunzel and Flynn took their first taste of the wedding cake. The new couple was thankful their friends had helped them prepare the perfect wedding twice. As they rode away, Rapunzel cried out happily, Best day ever!